Hi, this is Richard Cogen Paint Techniques. I recently completed work on a master bathroom that among other things required the removal of old wallpaper so the walls could be painted. The house was fairly old and the bathroom had been neglected for a long time, so you can never be sure of what you'll find once you remove the wallpaper. The slideshow picks up after the wallpaper had been removed. The bathroom had a bathtub on one side and a shower stall on the other. The entire interior of the bathtub had been wallpapered above the tile line, as was the rest of the bathroom. After removing the old wallpaper, the first thing I noticed was that the plaster walls were dinged up pretty bad. Judging by the number of gouges and scrapes, I suspect that somebody had removed a previous layer of wallpaper with a scraper. At this point I had patched the holes and gouges and had skim coated the walls, but had not yet sanded. A skim coat is a thin layer of joint compound that is applied to the surface of the walls and then sanded smooth for painting when it is dry. Along the way I discovered that the medicine cabinet had been installed improperly and just papered over, so this too needed to be reset properly before painting could begin. I also found some rot in the corners of the window sill as well as chip paint on the interior surface. This was ultimately repaired with a combination of wood filler and caulk. There was also a fair amount of gapping between the walls and trim that needed caulking. Several other minor items such as doors that didn't close properly and missing grout along the wall tile interface were identified and resolved. Lastly, the cast iron cover of the steam radiator had some rust on it that caused the paint to lift off. The rust was remediated and the voids were patched before repainting. After all of the repairs and prep work were completed, the ceiling, doors, window, trim, and walls were painted. The doors and trim were done in semi-gloss paint while the ceiling and walls were done using Benjamin Moore Aura Bath and Spa Matte Finish Paint. The matte finish gives a nice soft appearance as opposed to the hard shiny surface you get with traditional semi-gloss paints. Now the bathroom is easy on the eyes and has a sense of newness to it and going with a lighter color on the walls resulted in a much more open feel to the room than it had with wallpaper. The combination of addressing the myriad of small issues in the preparation phase and paying attention to detail like cutting in clean straight edges in the paint phase has given this bathroom a facelift that will last many years to come.